I'm trained as an architect originally from Adelaide and I moved over to Melbourne after travelling for a while and uh, worked for an architect for a year and a bit and yeah, moved over to Melbourne about this time last year and, and now started my Masters at BCA. Mainly like figuration, um, so I'm very interested in figurative painters. Uh, I love Egon Schiele, um, so a lot of Austrian artists. So that kind of came about really by experimenting with surface and I wanted to leave a bit of ambiguity, comfortability and vulnerability, but but mainly I wanted to main leave interpretations up to the viewer. I used uh, a lot of offcuts and ripped uh, denim that I got from the Salvation Army, using loosely my own figure as a reference um, to kind of create that sense of intimacy. Like all artists, was um, interested from a young age, always drawing and painting, uh, and through school I did HSC art, and then was really uh, excited and keen to follow it through and really pursue my passion. So studied at the National Art School um, and had a series of really fantastic teachers that really shifted the way that I uh, look at things, the way that I approach art making, particularly from the conceptual side. Um, and really gave me a lot of energy in terms of making art a career. So this works part of sort of a broader series um, where I paint shipping containers and container terminals from photos um, taken from the train or from a moving car. I'm Alessandra Joseph um, and I've just finished at the National Art School and I'm just starting up my own practice. I looked at um, a lot of the female abstract expressionists, I looked at um, contemporary Australian painters, particularly landscape and abstract painters. Um, I did try to look at female painters in the contemporary art world as well and that was a big influence and that was a really important thing to me. Um, and just the people around me were creating really interesting work so that was great. I think I'm still at, at kind of at a crossroads everyone wants you to define yourself as either figurative or abstract so I was kind of I'm still kind of unsure so I went more intuitively um, with that particular painting. I just thought about the space that I was in um, yeah and just tried to reinterpret that 